What's going on, Scorpio gang, gang, gang? Hope all is well with you guys. To my returning OG subscribers, what's popping? What's good? To my newly subscribed, hey y'all, thank you for allowing the channel to continue to grow. I really, really do appreciate that. To my members only community, I love, love, love you guys. To the moon and back, you know that. This is a Scorpio affair, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, anywhere you got Scorpio placements in your chart. Grab your boo, your hookah, your blunt, your spliff, your coffee, your tea, your cornflakes. Whatever it takes, Scorpio, to tap into these energies like we always do around about this time. If you should see an ad, let it play for at least a minute or so so your girl can get all the credit from YouTube. I'm currently running a $45 personal reading special today only. Cash out and email me, guys. Everything else you need to know is in the description box below. I appreciate every single thing you guys do for me and my channel. I love, love, love you guys so, so much, Scorpio. You know that. Let's get into the energy. Somebody's humiliated, Scorpio. Somebody is ashamed. Somebody is made to feel ashamed about something they did, some type of indiscretion here, something they did to you behind your back. It's coming to the surface. And somebody is being humiliated. This is a love interest. <clears throat> this person never thought they'd be caught. They thought they were smarter than the average fucking Scorpio bear. And that's probably where they start fucking up. Because what I'm getting is this person thought that you was more into them than you were your damn self. And that's where, that's where shit went awry. Because let me, let's be clear. Nobody means more to Scorpio than Scorpio. We found on this journey that when there's no Scorpio left, it just ain't no Scorpio left. We ain't got no fucking help from nobody but the man above. That's why we fear him and we only deal with him. Moving forward, let's see what's going on here. They ought to be fucking humiliated. Outdated, expired, disused, old news, discarded. You getting rid of that shit. You throwing that shit in the mon in Monday's trash. That shit is going out. That shit going south. Okay, period. And then you um pull in their feelings. Yeah, now you in your feelings because you humiliated. Now the joke's on you, bitch. Ha ha ha. Who laughing now, clown? With your outdated ass. And, and this person, when it, when, with this being your first car outdated, that means this person should have been left. They should have been out your life. They ain't even your vibe. They ain't even your speed, Scorpio. This this person ain't even got enough character to go where you going. Fuck. And now you in your feelings. What feelings? You ain't got no feelings. You humiliated. The only time a narcissist have feelings is when they exposed or humiliated or caught. That's the only time they show in that's the only time they in their feelings, and it ain't about you, Scorpio. It's about the fact that damn I got caught. What the fuck? It's that type of shit. You're caught, bitch, with Scorpio. Try it with another sign. It says busting out the receipts. Uh-huh. Scorpio got proof. Scorpio, listen, we intuitive like a motherfucker, and we read niggas, period. But the problem is we have we have receipts too. Because the intuition is what leads us to the receipt. Who am I talking to? Triggered. Now this person triggered by something they seeing now. See what I'm saying? Look at them. Oh, now you ain't humiliated no more. Now you in rage. Now you jealous. Now you envious. Now you know the control gone. You know Scorpio gone. And you see Scorpio with somebody else. Somebody better. Somebody who's more purposeful where she's going or where he's going. And it's triggering this person. Why? Because they're fucking narcissists. They got caught. <laughs> yeah, you got caught. What you thought you was going to keep operating in your south node on Scorpio, boo? No. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. Now who being triggered? Okay, now you pulling don't want it if it's that easy. Period. If it's that easy for you to be deceptive, to be cunning, <laughs> charming, whatever the fuck, I don't want this shit. And Scorpio, you lit the fuck up. What I say? That's why they mad. That's what's triggering them. You move right on past this shit like it was 
you know, like, it wasn't nothing. You just like, okay, you call, the gig is up, I'm out. <laughs> Hey, because with Scorpio people, that's why I hate when they talk about us. When we say we done, we done talking about your ass. We done feeling about your ass. We done calling your ass. We done. Like, how dare you go out after we done and after you done what you done for us to be done. You out here spreading lies talking about Scorpio. was you The, scor the story reverse. It's Scorpio who was sleeping with somebody else. It's Scorpio who in their feelings. It's Scorpio who I hear lying. Come on, man. Take your ass to sleep. Look what your overall end just say, because that's it. Kiss my ass. <laughs> to the haters. It's like when we done, kiss our ass, we out. We don't have no time to keep playing back and forth with y'all and trying to see what we already know. Not Scorpio. Period. I don't know who I'm talking to, but you ought to be humiliated, bitch. Stop trying, Scorpio. Scorpio, the biggest players. In the world if we want it to be. Who got time? Who got time to add extra layers of extra bullshit in their life? Not Scorpio. That's outdated shit. That's little girl, little boy shit. Period. Why is outdated here for Scorpio expired? <laughs> Two minutes, Scorpio. Somebody with these old outdated ass player, player beliefs. Come on. That shit dead. People don't even have to play no more. People, it's people who want to have sex and don't have nothing connected on the other end of it. You ain't got that, you ain't got that get nobody the ring and the promise bullshit no more. You can just see somebody nice looking, somebody you attracted to and say, hey, what's up with me and you going somewhere and doing something? They be, it, it, it's going on just like that. Like, who get in a full-fledged relationship tricking somebody about a promise and a ring only to, to deceive them. It don't make sense. Make it make sense. Like you got to be a fucking retard with a mental problem. <laughs> On top of that. Why is that outdated here for Scorpio? Like why? I feel like it be the narcissist's behavior though. It's like the chase. It's like them, you know, getting with somebody who going to believe the bullshit. And then the ultimate prize to them is like shutting that shit down. Like, okay, that's dumb and retarded as fuck, too. I don't understand it. The King of Cups in reverse on outdated. What I said? This person was never meant to, to go to that next level with you, Scorpio. They ain't got that type of character. To sit in the room with people who trying to invest a million dollars, 500K I just heard in your business. Something you started in your garage. You ain't got time to have this type of person with you. Somebody who's envious and jealous of your opportunities. Somebody who's sitting right there with their bad intentions and slowing your shit down. That's what this person did. And then they were exposed to some what I said. They was exposed, period. Because once you got to that other part, where you in the room with them investors, God wasn't finna, wasn't finna allow you to miss out on that opportunity again for this nut. Because he talking about he and his feelings because he got caught. You got caught so Scorpio can be in the room with the millions. Who not understanding this? That's why you being exposed. It ain't got shit to do with Scorpio. It got shit to do with divine timing. The seven of wands. It's time for Scorpio to stand up and go. I'm tired of trying to, you know, stand in my power with you. I'm tired of fighting against myself with you. The seven of wands, what am I trying to stand for in this shit? You a narcissist, so you will never allow me my independence. That's the worst thing can happen to a narcissist. You be independent inside the connection with their retarded ass. Now they feel like you leaving them behind all of a sudden. It just be weird shit for Scorpio. Why are they in their feelings? Because they know they fucked up the family dynamic that was fake and fucked up in the first place. Like, <laughs> this is like imaginary love or some shit like that. This is some shit they want you, they want you to keep drinking this Kool-Aid, Scorpio, and you ain't drinking it. You ain't even tasting it no more. You calling a spade a spade and you moving on, give a fuck if you and your feelings. Didn't nobody care about Scorpio being in their feelings all these years, staying and being loyal when people was... 
you know, on their demise and sleeping with their wives and husbands and doing witchcraft to kill their children. Who am I talking to? The Ten of Cups in reverse on in their feelings. They mad because, um, what? They couldn't make you happy? You was never intended to make me happy. The Page of Pentacles? That little bit ass investment you made? That look, that little bit ass, them, them, uh, what you call them, um, them sued sale messages that you was telling me what you thought I wanted to hear. That ain't what I wanted to hear. That sound good. I want you to tell me the truth. Scorpio want the truth for real. When we say keep it real, we mean it. Y'all just be saying it because it sound good. Why is the page of pentacles here with the ten of cups? This person know they was incapable of happiness and a family dynamic with who? Queen of Swords coming out in the reverse. This person knew they was incapable of speaking the truth. <laughs> they knew better. They knew they couldn't be disciplined in that family dynamic, me, you, 101, every single day. You gonna figure it out. That's what they scared of. And now, now it's been exposed. Why? Because it's time. <clears throat> it's time for your next chapter, Scorpio. And these people, places, things, ailments, diseases, uh, poverty, this shit can't go to the next, to this next dimension with you, it can't, so God is, you shedding off of most of it, and God getting rid of the rest, period, you're busting out the receipts, the ten of pentacles, I can't make it up, it's always something else behind curtain two, it's always something else behind curtain two, and it's always gonna be a gamble, it's always gonna be a risk, but what I know, Scorpio, is God always going to be there for you. Favor ain't fair. I feel like he always going to come to our rescue when it comes to us. Because we family. The night of source, he coming. Make no haste, he coming. Period. That ten of pentacles is needed. That's, that's your next phase. That's you crossing over, Scorpio. That's your, that's, your, that's your dreams being confirmed. That's confirmation. That ten of pentacles, that, 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 that's confirmation you went in the right direction. It's confirmation that you needed that loss. It's confirmation that you don't need to accept that job offer. Who am I talking to? This happening quick. The receipts. See, what y'all don't know, this receipt in the middle school, God got our receipts. He got the evidence by Scorpio. He got the final say. He's in charge of promotion. That's why this uh, receipts is being clarified by the Ten of Pentacles first. God said, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just because you got over that obstacle right now. Let me give you this breakthrough real quick to let you know that me and you both in alignment right now. That everything that just happened yesterday... It was supposed to happen. And what happened tomorrow, you didn't know nothing about it because God had already taken care of it. He was just waiting to see if you was going to be faithful and cross over. You crossed over. God got the receipts. I ain't got to prove shit to y'all. I ain't got, I don't care how much you're in your feelings. Favor ain't fair. I keep hearing that and God got the receipts. He keeping real time count. Y'all motherfuckers be lying. Y'all don't even keep up count. Y'all just lie. Why is the Knight of Swords here? God come quick for us. He come quick. The Four of Pentacles. When he, when he feel like you holding on to something you can't shake. You got a grip on it so hard. to See, that's loyalty. That grip right there. That Four of Pentacles, that's loyalty. Who can argue with you about that? God ain't finna sit here and, and, and feel a certain type of way about Scorpio being a loving person. Being loyal to somebody who spit in their face, who had a third party situation, who never took care of them. And all they have to say is bad shit about Scorpio. When God know you got something you can't shake, he come in. He show it to you in clear, clear day. He show you that future. He give you that vision. He give you that download, that confirmation. Who am I talking to? It make you turn your back on some folks. It'll make you turn your back on some folks. Looking forward into your future. And I'm talking about when God opened a portal. When he, when it's something, you know how we see them cars where everything around it black. But in that little mirror, it's number green. It's nothing but green. And for some reason, you get to a point in your life 
where you don't see the dark no more. All you see is the green. Now, who am I talking to? When God see you holding on, he said, let me show you something. Let me show you something. Keep your eyes on me. Don't worry about tomorrow. It's already gone. I mean, don't worry about yesterday. I'll handle that. And I'm the only person that can handle tomorrow. So let's go and you cross over. I'm going to trigger the three of wands. Yeah, see, it's something be in us that be triggering us to stay with these clowns. But when you cross over, you get help from God. All them little impurities and shit that was left that you, you know, that residue. Sometimes God have to wipe us clean and just, you know, charge it to the game because he got the receipts. See, people wonder why he keep charging into the game for Scorpio because he got the receipts, bitch. Y'all don't. Y'all don't know what happened with Scorpio in their prayer life and connection with God. So keep your mouth off. We ain't in competition. I keep hearing there ain't no competition. Scorpio stay in their own lane. Because see, you making five million. I might not need five. I might just need 5,000 for what I'm trying to do in my life. Favor ain't fair. And Scorpio don't tell you everything that's going on in their life, especially with their finances. Period. On trigger, you're pulling the three of wands and not a hierophon. What I say, you're being spiritually guided, protected, spiritually gifted. The page of swords. You on a whole nother journey, Scorpio. You crossed over. You crossed over. Yeah, it feel uncomfortable right now because who, who, any change is uncomfortable. Whether it's good or bad. You still got the, it, it requires action is what I'm saying. I'd rather require action for something good, though, than something bad. And that's what this crossover and doing this page of, page of swords is just another confirmation of somebody really being intrigued about the next phase in their life. Somebody who's who crossing over, who stepped into it. I told you Scorpios are bringing this shit down. We don't want it if it's that easy. We scared of some shit. If it's easy, we scared of it. I don't want it if it's like that. The five of swords, what I say? If it's easy, I don't want it. If, it. if it don't challenge me, if it don't make me want to be better, if it don't inspire me, I don't, I don't want nothing to do with it. I promise you I don't. Scorpio don't. You don't. Because the only type of shit that kind of thing come with is the five of swords energy. See, we know that from, we know that from past experience. That old, you know, hey, how you doing? I like da -da -da -da. everything they say is, is what you need wanting them to say. Everything they doing is what they think you want them to do. But they got one goal <laughs> when it's that easy like that. They looking for easy too. They not going to find it with Scorpio. That five of swords, we're not trying to be in that energy. Why? Because our life don't consist of five of swords energy. We have clarity now. We, we learn so many lessons now to, like I said, what, two months ago our crown chakra been activated. Like these mind games, they mind blowing for them, not us. It's just people to us, it's just people in their feelings. Because they're not able to attack Scorpio no more. Because they're not able to single-handedly take Scorpio down and conquer him no more. Now they're feeling that five of swords energy. It's being projected back. Why? Because you, you bringing it to me. I ain't finna absorb that shit. I ain't even finna sit here and argue with you about it. I might laugh and make your ass angry as hell, but I'm not... I'm not. I can't. The four cups in reverse. Now who bored? Now who losing their mind? Now who missed out on the opportunity of a lifetime? You miss out on Scorpio. You miss out on several opportunities. Several. I'm talking about past, present, and the future ones. And see, that's the problem you got to go because you weren't supposed to be there for the past, the present, or the future. You stayed too long. It was too easy. We got a hold of some shit that was too easy, Scorpio. Everything went status quo. Everything was too smooth. Now everything falling the fuck apart. Moving forward. Why is the four cups in the reverse? Why settle for the bullshit when the emperor right round the fucking corner? Scorpio with that four cup, that five of swords. First of all, you say it's too easy. I don't want it. That sent them into their fields. And then the four of cups in reverse. You like, shit, I'm tired of missing out on opportunities because I'm still in this bullshit. 
I keep telling God I want me a real man or a real woman, and I keep sitting here with this 100% piece of shit. And the emperor right there, right in my face, right in my energy, just waiting on me to let go of some more shit. Because why? You lit the fuck up. Everybody looking at you, Scorpio. Everybody won't back in. Even the new people won't in. You sending out that energy, that energy of, I'm, look, I'm healed, I'm free. I don't give a damn what nobody think. They can kiss my ass. I'm liberated. Whatever your word is, okay, <laughs> for you coming back to self. And it's attracting emperors, empresses, royalty, shit that, you know, that you, Scorpio, when you begin to release, God is teaching us something about releasing, how, how transference works. We got to release some stuff to get some stuff in. You lit up because you're doing that shit, Scorpio. You ain't in your feelings. You making decisions from totally different places than other people. Period. The fool. You lit the fuck up because you took that leap of faith. Every time Scorpio take a leap of faith, we're going to bet on us and God. And God is us. We are him. That's why we winning. You think we worry about what? how many bedrooms you got? <laughs> Soon as I said that, the five of wands came out in reverse. I ain't in competition with two. I don't need five bedrooms. I just want three. See, that's the type of shit people be people be mad at Scorpio like they, you know, they be trying to up and live beyond their means, trying to outdo Scorpio. And Scorpio like saying, "Damn, I, I'm glad they winning. If they winning, I can win." That's it. We ain't trying to compete with you. We know ain't no competition. We more tapped in. And then we going to ask the universe for what we are. We got sense enough to know that praying for shit that we're not, we're not going to get it. We understand what manifestation really means. Not what they say it means to sell books. Why is the five of wands in reverse? We ain't in competition with nobody. I heard that competition shit in the beginning of it. The five of cups in reverse. See, competition brings sorrow. Competition brings depression. Competition brings... People wanting to assume other people's identity. We avoiding that type of shit. The five of cups in reverse. We lit the fuck up. How you think we stay lit? We stay lit because we, we, we created this. And in this creation, we created that Scorpio's going to be lit as fuck. That we're not going to be in our feelings when we make decisions about our lives and who we choose to spend it with. And for all your players and soothsayers and gift the gabbers and whatever your manipulation tactic is, it just simply don't work on Scorpio no more. It's neither a good thing or a bad thing. It just don't fucking work with Scorpio no more. So if, if you a player, I mean, play on. If you think you can conquer Scorpio or whatever this shit is y'all be doing, go ahead. The eight of wands communication over because I feel like Scorpio, you, you back out there. You stepping back out. You got your money together, your business stable. You settled into your new house. Yeah, somebody getting a house. Somebody pulled a house out the sky. Somebody inheriting a house. And somebody just having one built from the ground up. I've been saying that for the last year. I done heard several um, praise reports about moving into my new place, my apartment, my whatever. But I'm ready to hear about those brown groundbreaking homes. Because that's what I keep hearing. Somebody building some shit from the ground up. Somebody having to relocate for property. And a new beginning. Let's see. What's the situation going on now, Scorpio? What's the energy here? Yo, you're on a whole nother journey. You don't even see this type of shit no more. The five of wands competing with somebody. Your first card, the fool. It's like, why y'all bitches over here arguing? Let me backwards dive over here to this backflip dive over here to this damn uh, other opportunity, this other source of income. Why y'all bitches depressed and worrying about these men that ain't going to do right. And, you know, you keep picking the bullshit and letting the bullshit come in. You keep worrying about what people think. You know, you 35, you should be married by now and you're not. All that stupid shit that society tell you, let society tell you who you are instead of knowing who you are. 
knowing that it don't matter if you 60 years old when you first get married. If it's the right person, you winning. Let's see what's going on, Scorpio. What other energies here? Any other energies here? You're pulling heartbreak in the reverse. It says breakup, suffering, and grieving, unable to move on. That's in the reverse. So you're moving forward, like I said. These people, whatever this is, the people, the jobs that's being exposed, either something is being exposed, exposed, or something is being handed to you that's better than where you at. Either way, both of them prompt you to move. Whatever this is, God is prompting you to move, Scorpio. That's all. And he knows just what to do. Against time, it says rushing before it's too late. Took a long time walking on thin ice in the reverse. See, that's not your journey anymore. You just left that journey. And in that journey were people that was like that journey, that fit that journey. You didn't. You no longer fit that journey anymore. So that's why you able to cross over because that shit ain't, it ain't sticking no more. Now people want to gossip. Why? Because they don't know what happened. They don't know what the fuck just happened. Just last Saturday, Scorpio was in their company, smoking, drinking, talking crazy, looking crazy, letting y'all project that shit on them. And then now, a week later, Scorpio somewhere, they skin clear, they bag getting up, they getting rest, ain't no more bags under their fucking eyes, the bags going to the bank now. They have a peace of mind, they're able to meditate and get their shit together, they're able to vision a future. You're able to get a business plan together. You're able to start budgeting your money. You're able to, hell, start seeing your money. Now this clown gone. It's like, damn, I ain't realize I was pouring this much of my finances into this person. I'm thinking I need a, another source of income. No, I just need this bitch gone. Who am I talking to? Then you pull the love activation. See what I mean? Once all this shit released and you cross over to this next ascension or journey or dimension, whatever you want to call it, something... Your heart chakra is being activated. That's why all these people, the emperor, <laughs> your counterpart, ain't just one emperor. In this world, there's plenty of emperors. They're being activated. It's just like the eagle shit. I'm going to soar all the way to the top with a branch about the, the weight of our, what our, um, our, our chickies would be, and I'm going to drop it. And the one who catch it, I'm going to keep a middle note on him, and the next day I'm going to do it again. He might be the same one catching the twig. I don't know. Might be a different a middle note, and then I'm going to choose. And I'm going to get the pick of the litter. That's what Scorpio doing. We want the pick of the litter because we the pick of the litter. And we've been letting y'all motherfuckers pick and treat us like litter. Now we are the pick of the litter. We picking the litter. How about that? Love activation. We get what we want. We know what we want. That's the that's the biggest part of the fight one right there, knowing what you want. Knowing your self-worth. When you know your self-worth, you know what you want. You pulling the pregnancy card. <laughs> what I say? Love activation. Some of y'all getting married, getting getting married, pregnant, and loved up. Some of y'all getting uh pregnant, married, and loved up. Either way the scenario go. It's just how you want it to go, Scorpio. Maybe you did it untraditionally, per se, or according to what Google say, or niggas say, or people say. Don't get pregnant first. Okay, whatever. I'm pregnant first. I'm married now, and I'm happy. You did it the right way, and your ass divorced. So don't tell me. Don't 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 project. I want to hear. Move forward, Scorpio. What else here? You pregnant and happy. They divorced and miserable. We got ghosts in this in the reverse. See, that's them bringing that, projecting that energy. What if you get pregnant and he leave? Because they playing back your insecurities. That ain't nothing but the devil from the past relationship here. It says, attempt, abrupt ending, no closure, ending all communications. It's in the reverse. You ain't worried about ghosting. You know your self-worth. You know this person that you chose is the right person. You know they wouldn't do anything to harm you. Or the baby, or whatever this situation is. This could be just a, 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 a birth, a new birth of like new ideas. This could be like a, a, this could be a business. This could be anything. It don't have to literally be pregnancy, but for some of y'all, I'm getting it. This person would never leave you. <laughs> and that's why you're telling people, you know what, the overall energy is kiss my butt because it's like, come on, bro. 
third part, I knew it was going to come out in the reverse. You ain't got to worry about that. See, these people are trying to make you think all type of things in your ear, Scorpio, that could be going on because you went through this before. But the thing about it is where you at in your life and your journey, these people are not here anymore. They can't even they can't even get to you to tell you this shit. And if they if they could, you wouldn't believe it because you've healed from this shit. It's no way you're going to be caught up in a third party situation or in a situation with somebody ghosting you while you're pregnant or leaving you high and dry while you need them or any of this shit. You wouldn't go for it. And the only reason people are talking about you is because you stepped away. You moved, you removed your energy with a, on a whole nother journey. So these people don't see you anymore. They don't know what you're doing. So they speculate. And who cares? You somewhere happy, Scorpio. On the bottom of the deck. The overall energy is self-delusion, not seeing reality clearly, clearly lying to yourself, false notions about things. I feel like, again, that is energy that people are trying to project on you. They're trying to make you think that you're self-delusional now. What I was self-delusional when I was actually going through that shit, but now that I got myself together, I'm self-delusional. Come on, Scorpio. We're not going to allow anybody to project their energy Towards us because they're not doing healing and because you cross over and they don't know what the fuck you doing now All they see is the result You know, they, they coming in at the ninth end and they seeing the finished product. They didn't see all the hell and, and, and footballs full of shit you had to crawl to to get there All right, Scorpio, if you're still with me, like, subscribe, join the membership Let those ads play for a minute or so so your girl can get all the credit from YouTube Today only I'm running a $45 personal reading special. Get at me guys. I love you. See you in the next video.